Good morning, Sarah, and good morning, everyone. We're starting out with a lot of cloud cover right now, but the rain staying well down to our south, and this seems to be the trend that will hold throughout the entire day. With high pressure sitting right over us, it's right enough to uh, cut off that rain, mainly around Richmond to the south. Now, this northern edge, we'll keep an eye on that. Fairly light and spotty. Some of that could inch a little closer to D.C., places like Easton, even Ocean City into the afternoon, but even those places should be fairly light compared to what they're going to see in southern Virginia and North Carolina today. So this high pressure system should be pushing off the coast, and then we're going to see dry weather for the next couple of days. A return flow is going to help our temperatures warm up close to 70 through the middle of the week. Futurecast does show how most of that rain stays well down towards the south, so areas like Norfolk it's set to be pretty soggy today, and it's a pretty drastic cutoff of where you get the rain and where you don't. Now, uh, Futurecast sometimes uh, underdoes the very light rain on the northern edge, so again, I could see places like Ocean City and St. Mary's City getting some light rain today. But otherwise, uh, most areas around the mid-Atlantic clear out tonight, and we should see even more sunshine during the day tomorrow. Right now, 53 at the airport, 59 downtown Baltimore and Centerville at 50 51 degrees. We're going to be climbing through the 50s this morning and top out mid 60s later today. A lot of clouds hanging around, but at least you don't have to worry about any rain if you are running errands. The winds will be a light out of the northeast, five miles per hour. We do get a little bit cooler tonight, fall back into the 40s. And with the dew points in the 40s, probably see some fog tomorrow morning. Could set you back a little bit on your morning commute. Otherwise, sunshine for your Tuesday. And we warm up upper 60s to low 70s by the afternoon. And we stay that way for the first week of November. It looks pretty mild. 72 Wednesday. Great day to plan at activities out. Doors. Thursday then has a chance for a few showers, 68 degrees, but we're still close to 70 Friday, and then we're cooler over the weekend.